Hi friends, today I am going to discuss about carcinoma breast staging. Staging of carcinoma breast which is very important in our exams. For this we have to know the basic TNM staging, tumor, nodes and metastasis. Coming to the tumor classification or staging. The first and foremost is the TIS. IS means in situ. Ductal carcinoma in situ or Pages disease comes under TIS. Coming to T1, the tumor size if less than or equal to 2 cm in its greatest dimension comes under T1. If it is, if, if it is in between 2 to 5 cm T2, more than 5 cm T3. T4 is uh, divided into 4 types. Chest wall involvement is considered uh, under 4A. Pectoral is major involvement does not come under 4A. And in 4B, skin involvement like edema, ulceration and PUD orange appearance of skin comes under 4B. Edema, ulceration and PUD orange appearance of breast comes under 4B. Chest wall involvement and skin involvement, there is no re nipple retraction does not comes under 4B. 4C is combined uh, features of 4A and 4B. Both are involved, chest wall and skin. And this is the most important thing. Inflammatory breast, breast carcinoma comes under 4D. This is checked in our exams many times. And these are the four types of uh, T, T4. Coming to the nodes. All these are... Uh, Ipsilateral. We are talking about if we are talking about N1, N2, N3, it is all ipsilateral only. If contralateral nodes are involved, this uh, is considered to be as a metastasis of the carcinoma. Most important thing to re to be remembered. N0 is no node involvement. N1 mic is micro metastasis to the lymph nodes. N1 is mobile axillary lymph nodes. N2 is divided into N2A and N2B. N2A is fixed matted axillary lymph nodes. N2B is internal mammary lymph node involvement without axillary involvement is the key feature. Fixed matted axillary lymph nodes is N2A. Internal mammary as N2B. N3 is divided into three types. N3A, N3B and N3C. N3A, infraclavicular, uh, ipsilateral infraclavicular lymph nodes if involved comes under N3A. Internal memory with axillary lymph node as well involved, uh, it is denoted as N3B and supraclavicular lymph node involvement is N3C. All these are ipsilateral, remember this, ipsilateral lymph node involvement only. Coming to the metastasis, M0 is no metastasis and M1 is metastasis is present. This is the basic thing. Coming to the real staging of breast carcinoma, stage 0 is uh, TIS, N0, M0. Stage 1A is T1, N0, M0. Stage 1B is T0, R1 with nodal metastasis. N1 micro metastasis. Stage 2A is T0 or 1 with nodal metastasis N1 or T2 with no nodal metastasis. Stage 2B Stage 2B is T2 N1 or T3 N0 without metastasis. Stage 3A is T0, 1, 2 or 3 with N2 or T3, N1 without distant metastasis. Stage 3B is T0, T4, N0 or 1 or 2 without distant metastasis and stage 3C is NET with N3 without distant metastasis. Stage 4 is 
NET or NEM with distant metastasis is the key here. This comes under stage 4. Uh, we have to analyze this and you have to remember this. And stage 2, stage 3 are most commonly asked the questions uh, major. N1 starts from 2A, N2 starts from 3A. N3 is 3C, T4 is uh, 3B, from 3B. You have to remember these are very important things. 2A, N1, 3A, N2, 3C, N3. These are the uh, fo focus points to be remembered. And here I am going to give you an example to remember this uh, well. Consider a 40 year old lady uh, with a 3 into 3 centimeter mass in her left breast. Sight is important. And this mass is attached to the pectoralis major with skin involvement that is alteration is present. And fixed matted lymph node is present in left axilla and mobile axillary lymph node in right axilla is also involved that is tumor uh, cells are present in the right uh, axillary lymph node also so we have to uh, tell the which stage is the is this uh, lady comes yeah all the thing m most important thing here is skin ulceration Reg uh, Regarding whatever the size is, skin ulceration is involved and the size is 2 to 5 centimeters, between 2 to 5 centimeters, we can say that it is it comes under T4B ulceration, T4B. Coming to the nodes, if contralateral involved, metastasis is present and here the ipsilaterally fixed and matted axillary lymph nodes are present. That is fixed and matted lymph nodes are present, that is N2. N2A in particular N2, N2A and mobile axillary lymph node, mobile axillary lymph node uh, in contralateral side uh, is considered as metastasis, so M1, T4B, N2A and M1 is the thing and it comes under stage 4. My relative is in this stage T2 M0 M0 is diagnosed uh, as a uh, stage 2 A. Thank you and please like, comment, or share this video if you like the video. Have a nice day.